Eric Burden is with us this morning, and I'm so proud. Thank you for joining us on Sounds, mate. Morning. Thanks. Nice being here. Last night, you worked up the coast at Brown Doyleson Way, which is up towards Newcastle. Yep. So you would have got into bed about four this morning. Yep. You managed to make it, and I thank you for that. Uh, oh. Tonight, Eric, with his band, are at Blackton RSL, and tomorrow night, St. George Budapest Club. So try and catch him, because then he's off to Adelaide, and you don't want to miss him, I tell you. You formed the animals at the age of about 20, mate. What had you done uh, yeah. prior... Prior to that, I was a student. <laughs> Successful? Well, like a lot of other people in, uh, who uh, studied in England, I was I was set up and and sort of presented with this dream that uh, you know you would uh, be able to do certain things when you left college after five years of studying, which mm -hmm. was was a fallacy. I mean, uh, I ended up digging roads for a living after that, and then drifted into the music. Uh, yeah, well, music was always an ongoing thing at college. In fact, most of the bands of the 60s were formed out of colleges. I mean, it's true with the Beatles, it's true with the Stones. Yeah. It's true of a lot of those bands. They were, they were basically college bands. And, and that's where it all evolved. Mm. 67 was really sort of when you toured Australia, and it wasn't long after that you actually split. Mm. Do you think that there was much difference in Australian audiences today that you see now you come back uh, opposed to them? Well, not only in Australian audiences, but in Australians and their attitude and their outlook, period, is, is mm -hmm. immensely different to now to what it was then. For the better? Oh, absolutely. And it's really great to hear, um, you know, the, the, the kids who are just on previously talking about their, their, their concern about the, the, the nuclear situation right. and, and, and realizing that in Europe you are actually in it there whereas yeah you, you, you're, you're somewhat withdrawn from it but it's really great to see that people even though they're withdrawn from it still know about it a, a, yeah. a front line interest my word it's terrific animals have had what three reunions since they split uh yeah one concert one and two recorded mm -hmm. reunions is it hard to bring the band back together to do anything sure I mean, would you like to go to back to a high school reunion that would last a year with your old mates and everything I mean it's, mm -hmm. I don't know. It's I think there must difficult. have been some great memories out of that time, and you'd probably think, well, let's do it, one off again, and have a bit of fun. Yeah, but from, from my point of view, memories are back there, and future, you know, the future is here, and present is now. I, <clears throat> I, I've got no wish other than what I'm doing uh, at the moment is uh, I'm writing a book, it'll be, it'll be published in. Um, what a biography? Yeah, it'll be published in, in, in the UK. Next summer, our UK How long summer. have you been actually working on that? Um, a year. Uh, a year, but I started, the germ uh, germinated about 78. I, I started writing writing a novel at first uh -huh. and realized I didn't have the writing skills for that. So um, uh, the advice of publishers and friends around me, I, I got in, stuck into an autobiography. And uh, What'll that be called? I used to be an animal, but I'm all right now. <laughs> I love it. So it comes out sometime next year. Yeah. Look forward to that. And movies. Have you done many movies? Uh, yeah, I did an American one in 78. Uh, two German films in, in 79 and 80. And um, looking for more projects. I hope right. there's, a, there's a chance that maybe the book uh, will be picked up by we'll an American on agency. To, yeah. I hope so. Anyway, That'd right be so great. Now, new <clears throat> recording material. Can we expect any from Eric Burden? Well, yeah, in the, in the, new, in the new year where um, I'm talking, and I have been talking to Jim Stein and uh, on and off for the last uh, three years about production. Good way to be also, talking to you. Yeah. Spring, Bruce Springsteen was interested at one, one point, but he's too busy. Mm. I got lots of producers that want to work with me. It's, it's setting up a deal um, with a satisfactory uh, record company that will make sure that the product gets to the people. As right. It's been one of my ongoing problems. I've had so many problems with record companies over the last few years. It's, it's kind oh. of frustrating. Again, let's hope you can clear those up. I hope so. Thank you for coming in today. We'll Thank go you. back again. This one, 65.